Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Maury's Plays Let's Play of Animal Crossing Let's Go to the City or Animal Crossing City Folk on the Wii, of course. Um, and it's a bit later than usual, it's, it's basically night time, very starry sky tonight, it's almost 9 o'clock actually. Um, and I thought it would be nicer to play a little more in the evening, so we're going to of course do our daily chores. Um, have a look around town at night time, see who we bump into. I don't know if any special visitors visit at this time, but there are some things we may find at night time. Uh, we can definitely check the city for the research center, which I believe is on the main road. Uh, although we haven't had much luck there. Um, and also we might even find Wisp. And there's, I'm also looking for Gulliver as well. Gulliver should come out at night, but it's completely random, so I don't know if we'll actually bump into them, but hopefully... And um, we will. And also, we've still got our bubbles that we got from Phineas. Um, okay, so what to do first? I guess we should find our money rock first. Uh, we'll do that first, and then maybe we can check out what Nooks has. I believe it's open past 9 o'clock, the Nook way. Um, I hope so, anyway. Um, so, oh, that is bright. Look at the... That's so bright. <laughs> Okay, so we'll just grab our money rock first, because of course we need as much money as possible. Oh, it is the money rock! What are the chances? The first one we went to. That's going to save us some time. Nope, still no eighth bag. We will get... I'm not stopping this let's play until we have several eight bags. Oh no, hang on. Oh wait, what have we got in our pockets? Oh yes, a bunch of flowers, I think, from yesterday. Okay. So we may as well go and buy some more flowers in a second as well, actually. Um, just get rid of the last of the money bags. Yeah, I, I just logged on yesterday just to grab the flowers, that's all, and the money rock. So I guess we should head into... Might as well head into Nookway now, see what they've got, but mostly just to buy the other flowers. And then we can uh, do a bit of decorating down at the new path that we're laying. Hey, Tom Nook, welcome! We do have one item on special today. Ooh, what's it gonna be? What, is that it? You're not gonna tell us? Oh, wow! Oh, look! A space station! And a fruit table! And a gold lucky cat! Wait, how much is the gold lucky cat gonna cost us? Ah, very good, Mori. You have a good eye. That today's special. Mm, yes, a lucky gold cat. Oh, it's not as much as I thought. Uh, yes, we'll take it. That's got to be lucky. That's definitely going in the house. And also this. Great fruit table. 1,500 bells. We'll take that. Wow, lucky finds. Uh, we've got enough room to get all the flowers. We haven't, have we? Um, see if we can make some room here. Um... Okay. Are we holding anything? No. Okay. We'll have to grab three flowers for now and then maybe come back and get the fourth shortly. Oops. Yes, yellow pansy, 80 bells, quite a bargain. We'll take it. There we go. And this last one, we definitely want to come back for the space station as well. Uh, that's a really cool item, but we, we haven't got enough pocket space, so let's, let's, uh, we'll head out now and plant what we've got for the flowers, and, and maybe, maybe we'll lay some paths. We don't, don't want to spend too much time decorating, because we do want to go to the city at night. Um, oh, I've just remembered, it's also Wednesday, which means the marquee is open. Um. Where's our watering can? I've also read that... A silver watering can will increase our chances of a money tree. So that's something to think about. Wow, we've got lots of flowers we need to... We need to do something here. We were originally collecting yellow flowers, but it's just... It's gotten a bit crazy now. Okay, we'll head down to the path area where we were. We'll check the beach. Maybe Wisp will be here. But yeah, so I thought it was just a relaxing evening episode today. Especially since the a Nintendo Direct is happening <laughs> right about now. 
Uh, who's that? Pango, is that? Pango, what are you doing behind the fake money trees? Uh, oh, or the failed money tree, should I say? Oh, Popstar, good evening, I guess. It's evening, right? Boo, why is it so hard to meet new people and stuff? Why, Popstar, seriously, so hard. Uh, wow, well, you must have got some friends you can introduce me to. Come on, get out there, bring some new foes to our town. Wow, that's, uh... Yeah, I hate to break it to you, but the servers are, um... The servers are offline. I forgot what we were doing down here. Oh, yes, laying the flowers. Hey, Freckles. And also, oh, there's a weed here. And also checking, uh... Checking the beach as we go past for any potential coconuts. Nothing here. Apollo, you still got that hideous shirt. Okay, I think we need to lay some flowers this side, don't we? So yeah, we'll rearrange them at a later date, but we're just pretty much uh, planting them wherever for now. Can we put one here? Oops. We just have to hope a house doesn't move there. <laughs> okay, that will do for there. We'll go and place the gold cat in our house before we go for the money rock, I think. Just in case. So it doesn't look like Wisp is here, otherwise Wisp would have uh, said something by now, which is a shame. We've only seen him once, I think. you. Yeah, so Gulliver flies past in a UFO, I think. I never actually encountered it myself. Uh, I just know of it. Uh, and it happens at night, but it's totally random, and I don't even know if it's like at nine or at midnight, maybe. Okay, we're gonna go drop the lucky cat in our house first. Plant the last flower. Okay, we're a bit all over the place today. We've not, we've, we have no structure for today, really. We're just going with it. No, I don't want to open the menu. Okay, so we've got a lucky gold cat. Our grapefruit table should be great for feng shui. I keep forgetting to check if it's two tiles or one tile. Our feng shui is is doing really well, but I need to double check if at this stage, or in City Folk, if it's only one tile wide or two tiles wide. Uh, we are doing well collecting the fruit furniture. So we're actually out of green spaces, aren't we? Um, our house is starting to look very messy. <laughs> this has got to be luckier than the, the, the normal version. Okay. Oh, is it? no, that's the lemon table, isn't it? Yeah. So we're, this is, I actually really like this room. It's, uh... Very, very messy, but with, if we consider the feng shui we've got going on, it's a very it's a very good room, so I'm pleased with it. We've picked some good items, and something, once the house is bigger, we can, and we, we don't really care about feng shui so much, we can do much more with. Okay, so, uh, lucky cat is in position. Let's go and see if we can find the money rock. Oh, I thought I heard something then. No. Uh, and then we'll... Head to the city. See if we can find Mr. Rossetti. Wait. Oh, no. We already did the money rock. What am I talking about? For a second, I was so confused. Totally forgot. I am all over the place now. It's because I'm excited about the direct. I'm really hoping for some Animal Crossing news. I would love a Animal Crossing port. Uh, and probably by the time you watch this, you would have seen the Nintendo Direct this evening. 
Um, okay, I think we should check the Able Sisters, and then we'll head to the city to see if uh, Rossetti is there. Really hoping he is, because we still haven't seen that yet. Oh, a tie-dye shirt! Hi there, welcome to the Handmade Fashion Palace of the Able Sisters. Yeah, this, this, oh cool, like a visor thing. This, this episode is all over the place, I do apologize. That's a green tie-dye, I love the tie-dye. We might have to change up our outfit again. Uh, that looks absolutely perfect on you. I'll take it. Uh, it's 380 bells. Thank you. And a green knit hat. Oh, what does this look like? I, I, I don't know. It looks like we're about to rob somewhere. Like we're going to pull a ski mask down or something. I like the color of it, but we won't. I don't think that goes with the outfit. Can we get away with wearing a red pom-pom hat with a green tie-dye shirt, or is that too much? Hmm. It's a little bit too much. How much is this? An HMD! What? 1800 bells? Uh, that looks absolutely perfect on you! Shall I wrap it up? Uh, never mind. That's a little bit too out of our price range at the, mo the moment. Okay, we'll have to wear this shirt and hope for a bit of a better hat tomorrow. If not, we will put the watermelon shirt back on because we like to change up the fashion every now and then because it's something I, I rarely do in Animal Crossing games. I like to stick with one outfit and that's what we're trying not to do this time. Um, and I just want to show you yesterday when I came on to get the um, flowers, there was a notice. Um, not this one. Oh! Here we go. <laughs> this just in. We just received a rare piece of lucky gold cat in our showroom. No way. Yeah, we just bought it. But this one was here yesterday. February 14th is Valentine's Day. Maybe you should give that special someone a little present. We're going to have to send all the villagers presents for Valentine's Day. Um, okay, let's head to the city. I don't think we need to take anything with us. Uh, remove equipment. There we go. Uh, yeah, that'll do. Yeah, we'll worry about the sapling later. And we definitely want to come back and get the space station. If we remember. If not, I'll just grab it another time. Uh, okay, let's go to the city and hope Mr. Rossetti's there. Bus to the city, want to take the bus to the city. Hey, Captain, late night, night shift. How you doing? <laughs> he just never looks pleased. He's like, ah, another passenger. Okay, we made it to the city. Full, or not full moon, nearly a full moon, but clear skies. Few villages about. Okay, let's check on the, the oh, we can't go on the main road. No. We'll just check the other side. I'm pretty sure it's this side, but... No! Oh, it's Wednesday as well, so Red will be open. What Red should have new, uh, new furniture. Kicks is gone. Gracie Grace is closed. Okay, let's check out Red first. And we'll check out the marquee as well. We ne you never know, we might see Frillard, which is a super rare encounter. Um, but I don't know if we will. Well, if it ain't our favourite cousin, a hearty welcome to you, Maury. Hey. Oh, wow, basketball net. And some construction pieces, which I'm pretty sure you could buy in Nooks. Oh, cousin, I'm so glad someone with an arti uh, artist's eye finally stepped into my humble shop. I fell in love with that proper painting the first time I laid eyes on her. Yeah, you saw us a fake last time, Red. Which wasn't fair, it was the first time we went in your shop and it was fake! <laughs> I had to beg and plead with the previous owner to sell. Old Red was on his paws and knees for that one. Now if I had my druthers, I'd like to, uh, to, uh, uh, as to keep it around forever. But if my number one best cousin wants it, then I guess I can part with it for a mere 3,920 bells. That's pretty cheap for a painting, it's probably the cheapest actually. I think they're normally over 4,000 aren't they? Ha, cousin, cousin! 
You will not be sorry with this one. That's a crazy red guarantee. Please take a look around. Uh, let old red know if anything else strikes your fancy. Well, it's good to know that we have a week to buy these things now. Because I think this is probably a red exclusive. Um... I would dare, yeah, definitely that would be a red exclusive, I think. Not sure about this. I think we might be able to get that in Tom Nooks, uh, but maybe we'll come back for the, uh, we'll come back for the basketball net uh, later in the week, I think. I like these cases as well. It's a shame we can't have these items. Ah, oh, yes, Maury, how's that referral business coming along? Crazy Red doesn't advertise, you know. We live and die by the word of mouth. Look, I'll give you another invitation so as long as you promise to give it to someone you trust. And thank you. Wait, we got another invitation? We haven't even got rid of the first invitation. <laughs> do we have to... What do we have to do with the invitation? They're not for real people. That's so strange. I, maybe they're for villagers. Do we invite the villagers to... Reds? Who have we got out here now? Dizzy, is that you? Axel, no! Dude! Uh, are they making bus seats out of slabs of solid granite now? That bus ride is harder than your, on your glutes than burnout set of squat thrusts, wonk. We're forever getting the uh, animals wrong. What am I doing? Right, well, let's go and have a look at the marquee. Move out of the way! <laughs> okay, even if we don't... That, that, you can just see Frillard there. Even if we don't see Frillard, we, we need to get another emotion or a reaction. So we may as well check it out. I think it is on a Wednesday night, isn't it? Welcome to the Marquee. If you'd like to see the show, tickets are 800 bells. We can't know. It only happens once a week. Uh, what show would you like to see today? Oh. Disbelief, disappointment, glee, realization. Hmm. How about glee? So the show you'd like to see is glee. Wait, are there certain reactions linked to Frillard, maybe? Maybe we just uh, made a mistake there. Okay, well, that'll be 800 bells. Thank you, the show will begin in a few moments. Please make your way into the theater. Okay, we're heading into the theater. Who's it gonna be? I think at least uh, there's, oh, there's no villagers in here yet. <laughs> okay, well, we can sit down at the front. MC, thank you for your patience, everyone. The Marquis is pleased to welcome Dr. Shrug, starring in a feature presentation, Glee. Hey, yes, you have a full house. I mean, there's one person. <laughs> thank you, thank you, and thank you. Dr. Shrunk is in the house. Uh, hum, you know, I'm so happy right now that I just got to show it. Want to know why? Why? Because I had my palm read, and the fortune teller said, Shrunk, your palm tells me much. You are very daring. I was happy to hear that, so I began dancing around. Then I said to her, tell me more, please. And she said, Shrunk, I can see that no one laughs at your jokes. Still, you go on stage every day, Shrunk. It is so daring to be that unfunny. Can you believe it? I'm the most daring comic in the biz. Yeah. The doctor is out. I, I, is that supposed to be funny? That wasn't funny. The last couple of ones have been a little bit funny. Uh, but yeah, good old Dr. Shrunk, I guess. And uh, we hope you enjoyed the show today. We hope to see you again in the future. Did we learn one? Oh, here we go. Yay! We've got some really nice ones. Happiness, curiosity, glee. If we could just get the laughing one. That's my favorite emotion. Okay, well, there we go. It only takes a few minutes to get a new emotion. So that's kind of why we have to do that on a, on a Wednesday. And this is a really cute item as well. Wish we could get that. Um, but I don't know if there's anything else to do in the city now. We've checked out red. Everywhere else is closed. Um, oh, yes, we still need to go to Shampoodles at some point. And Katrina's. It's a shame that re the Reset Center isn't open. But let's head back now. Uh, we want to make sure we buy that station. Maybe we can talk to some villagers uh, just quickly in the town. Very peaceful music for the bus ride. Okay, so we definitely should talk to some villagers. See who's about.
Where does that bus go? How does it get out of town? There's no, there's nowhere for the bus to go. Why has no one questioned that before? Okay, let's see who's around and then we'll go and get that uh, space station. I think we should plant a another money tree and water it. Hey, Pango, we spoke to you. Where's everybody else? Oh, it's Popstar. You kind of scared me a little. Uh, I'm like totally broke. I think I went a little shopping crazy the other day. Oh, that reminds me. We need to donate our painting. What? Don't pretend to empathize with me because you've got a little pocket change. I'm not ashamed to be low on bells. You shouldn't be ashamed. Right, let's go and plant a money tree and then we'll head up to the museum. And see if this painting is real. Okay, we're going to get rid of these trees. Because this is where I want loads of money trees. I think our axe is going to break soon. So yeah, according to Nookopedia, the silver... Oh, there's a fossil. The silver um, watering can increases the chances of money tree. We're going to go all out because we're feeling flush with 5,000 bells. And then... We're going to water it and walk around it so we don't accidentally step on it. I don't know if stepping on it affects it at all, but there we go. So I don't know how it increases your chances. Maybe like 10% or something, but every little helps. So who knows? Maybe maybe that's the start of a money tree. Maybe if we have to water it every day. I didn't think of that. We're going to have to make a point of watering that every day. Pango. Where's, why are we not seeing anyone else? We'll clear the shells later. Okay, yeah, we need to do a path down the center here as well, don't we? So this tree is gonna have to go. We might as well do a bit of tree clearing, might we? Uh, our axe is going to break soon anyway, so... There we go. This is going to be where the path goes. We'll just check there's no more trees to clear. Oh no, I hope a villager doesn't move in. Ah, oh, two villagers can move in on the path. And it should come all the way down here. It's going to be a great path. Come straight up to this house. So just to remind us that's our plan, we're just going to drop some, no, drop some tiles here. Because my memory is absolutely shocking. So if I don't do this, I will forget. Oh, you can do it on the slope. Okay, we might as well join it up then. Okay, there we go. That actually looks pretty neat. Cool. Okay, uh, to the museum. Wait, who's that? Filbert! Hey. Enjoying the night sky? I was waiting for you to come outside and play, Popstar. Hey, hey, listen. Hey, listen, it's a sign. <laughs> uh, you know those little signs that are all around town? When I first arrived here, those little things really helped me out a lot. You should check them out too, because you might learn something interesting. We, we, I think we know all the basics though, don't we? Uh, the bug catches way. Some bugs get up early, some sleep in, but late at night, most are asleep. I would love to experience um, Animal Crossing again for the very first time. 
having never played any of the games. My first one was the GameCube version. I would love to not have played any Animal Crossing game and then experience that again for the first time. That would be an amazing feeling. Ooh, there, welcome to the Moriland Museum. Make yourself at home, won't you? Uh, now then, may I assist you? Yeah, we've got a painting that we hope, we hope is real. A proper painting. Ooh, marvelous, the proper painting is rather more of a proper painting than I'd imagine. Oh, we took it. Now I must find a spot with the proper lighting to, uh, to do this beauty justice! Who now, do you wish to donate anything else? No, it's a, it's a genuine painting, not enough. Let's see where he put it. Um, but yeah, one summer, I think when I first got the GameCube version, it was just like, that's all I played every day with my brother. I didn't go out. I don't know what that says about me. <laughs> wow, there's the proper painting. Proper painting donated by Maury. There we go. Maybe we should take a little thumbnail opportunity here. Um, oh, I've just remembered, we can also do the keyboard shortcuts. There we go. Except it brings up a text box, which is a bit annoying. Uh, oh, we could have done the fossil. Oh, wow, this the art gallery is big, bigger in City Folk. This is huge. How many paintings are there? How long is this gallery? Wow. This is new for me because I never really played City Folk that much when it first came out because I didn't get on with the controls originally. Because um, I, I always thought it was a point and click. So I just didn't like it. I had no idea you could use the nunchuck. Um, so I'm excited to go and look in that room. But we'll wait until we donate a piece that goes in there. That way it will give us something to look forward to. May as well go and grab a coffee. We're still looking to unlock the gyro storage from... Um, Brewster. Oh, Pelly, hey, we haven't seen you yet. Oh, Phyllis, sorry, I mean, of course. What, what do you want? Listen, bucko, if you're trolling for a date, you can forget it. Oh, Phyllis, don't be like that. Now, shoo. I knew you were Phyllis. Grumpy, we should have guessed. Care for some coffee, it'll run you 200 bells, but it's well worth it. Yes, please. Oh, we only just had enough. Much obliged. I brew only my uh, handcrafted blends here. Phyllis, are you enjoying your coffee? Even if you don't, I think, I think I will enjoy mine. But we won't tell Brewster just in case. Drink up before it gets cold. Fresh from the pot is the only way. Thank you. I don't know how many coffees are at now. Is it like five? Ooh, exceptional, but could you expect anything less from the legendary Brewster? See, me and Phyllis are in sync, look. There we go, thank you. I can't even count how many years I've been working there. I really should have quit a long time ago, but I really uh, don't really have any skills and I'm too old to learn. Oh, Phyllis, you're just a downer all round. At my cafe, I serve coffee and nothing but. We need some friends. <laughs> Is anyone running homebrew so we can do some visits? Maybe I need to. I need to. I, I've got homebrew, but I haven't got the application for the online, so I'll have to do it. At my cafe, I serve coffee and nothing but. Oh, you can only buy one a day. They keep promising me an assistant or an automatic mail sorter or some kind of help, but it never comes. And folks wonder why I'm grumpy all the time. Oh, it's such a sad story. So sorry, Phyllis. But it was nice. It was nice to see you anyway, Phyllis. Let's uh, <laughs> let's get out of here quickly. Um, we'll just head into the town again, and we'll just see if there's any more animals wandering around. I was really hoping to see Wisp or. Or Gulliver today, but I guess we can settle for Phyllis because uh, she is of course Pelly's counterpart at night time In the uh, town hall actually, what are you doing here? You do not start until 10. That's right So I guess it's too late to see any visiting characters as well 
Uh, where else was I going to chop some trees down? That's right. We're going to chop some trees down over here. Up where we're burying all of our golden shovels. Oh, yes. Don't forget. Space station. Hey, Phil. Uh, Phyllis. <laughs> Freckles, how you doing? Oh, it's Popstar. It's totally dark. I got all distracted and stuff, I guess. Hey, Popstar, did you hear the news? More fake stuff was found at Crazy Red Shop. Oh my gosh, that place is so totally sketchy. Stay away unless you're, like, super desperate. Counterfeits are so tacky, ducky. You're not wrong. So, we're going to be... Oh, there's an orange tree here. We're going to be getting rid of these hardwood trees. Because we are only wanting cedar trees on the top tier, really. And I think we have a sapling in our pocket, so... There we go. Okay. Wow, we've got a lot of open space here, actually, haven't we? Right, I'm just going to grab some more oranges that we can sell inside Nooks. Because I don't know how much the space station is going to be, actually. I just realised we've got no bells. Um, let's drop this on the floor. Grab this. Keep those. Okay, we can grab. We're going to have to do a few trips, I think. No! Maybe we can clear the shelves after this. Let's sell these oranges, then clear the shelves. And then see where we are financially. See if we can buy the uh, space station thing. I really like the space items. And you don't often see them, so... Uh, welcome, please. Browse all you like. Yes, yes. Tell me what I can do for you. Sell. Actually, we probably should find out how much the space station is. It's going to be expensive, isn't it? Space station. Oh, not too bad. We'll have to come back. Oh, look, another shovel. <laughs> okay, we're spending more than we're making. But that's okay, because it's... Uh, we need to think of a word that can describe our random episodes where we don't actually do much. Because um, this is definitely one of those episodes. It's very far-fetched. All over the place. What's a good word that we can do to say, it's a far-fetched episode? Okay, now we're going to have to... Ah! I forgot you can't run on the path without um, picking up a tile. Okay, so let's uh, try not to dig up the existing ones. I don't know why I'm doing this. I just, I've never been able to get golden shovels so easily. So I just thought it was kind of cool to be burying golden shovels. Um, maybe they're worth a bit more money. So we're kind of saving up for a, a mortgage. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, let's go clear the shells. I think it's okay to run. I don't think running in this game is any worse than walking. As long as you stay on the same tiles. I could be wrong though. But yeah, let me know if you think you enjoy the, uh, if you like the night episodes more. Or if you know a specific time that we can see Gulliver or the Reset Center. If they only come out, say, after 11 o'clock or something, let me know. And then we'll have to do, like, a super late night. Um, how many space 
places have we got? Three more. I don't know if that's going to get us enough money. And it's always those random far-fetched episodes that tend to take longer than usual because we just keep doing little things. So I hope you don't mind. Oh, we've got a new cow as well, haven't we? What was their name? Tipper! <laughs> That's right, Tipper. We should probably introduce ourselves. Uh, should be out of boxes by now, hopefully. So we'll see what Tipper has to say. Because, oh, look at this. What, this is a random house? What a strange setup. Why is your furniture like this? Why is that not next to the wall? The bed's cool though. Oh, I've just realized this. Wait, 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 wait. Can you hear the gyroids? They sound like cows. Welcome, I can't offer you much except for my delightful company. That's genius, the gyroids sound like cows mooing. You know, sometimes I make fun of the other neighbours for being close. But it's not like I don't admire good friendships. It's just that I have really high standards. Take Freckles and Octavian, for instance. What a friendly vibe they bring to the village. I bet they'll be best friends forever. That's really sweet. We can be best friends if you like, Tipper. How about it? And I'm jealous of your mooing gyroids. I didn't, <laughs> I didn't know there was any mooing gyroids. I wonder what they're called. Uh, Mooingoid, or something like that. Is there an, is there a scientific word for the, the the moo of a cow? Now that would be interesting to find out. Okay, let's go and grab these uh, this space station. Hopefully, we're gonna have to sell these shells. I don't know if it's gonna be enough to be able to buy the station. We'll have to wait and see. Every now and then, you get like a really expensive shell. Ah, uh, oh, for that I'll give you 1,000. Oh no. We need like 800 more. How much, we, we, can we sell our broken axe? Cause it's gonna break. It's gonna break soon anyway. Oh, 50 bells. That's terrible. Okay, we're gonna have to do one more fruit trip. Uh, thanks much for stopping by. Come again soon. We will. We're gonna be like two minutes, and then we're gonna grab some fruit. Grab this fruit here. Can't see behind the house. I think we got it. There we go. Ah, we'll do this one. Okay, we can get five more. Wait, I hear a balloon. Oh, we're gonna miss it. Oh no, it's only now coming on. Oh, that was lucky. Or maybe it's unlucky, because do balloons spawn in Gulliver's place? Do they, can they spawn at the same time? Okay, let's see what we got. A ukulele! Nice! Sounds expensive. Sounds like we should be selling it. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, so we're going to go and sell these oranges. Might as well sell the ukulele as well, because we haven't really got a use for it. And now it's in our catalogue. I don't think it's like a, a balloon exclusive item. I think we'll be able to buy it again, so... We might as well make use of the present. All of that will give you 1,400 bells. That should be enough. Uh, 
a space station. We didn't buy this. We, we, we did. We, did we? Uh, no, we got something space, didn't we? But we'll take it anyway. Woo! Expensive. Okay, and actually, do you know what? We're gonna buy a new axe. Oh, 400 bells. I thought there were 500 bells. Yeah, we know how to use an axe. And we'll just take this cedar sapling as well, please. There we go. Cool. Okay, we'll just plant this cedar sapling so it's not in our pockets for tomorrow. So I think we need to start thinking about where we're going to put plant uh, trees next to the path. So I wonder if we can plant one just here. Uh, oops. Just in front of this tree here. That would be a really good place, I think. This one's growing next to, um, like, where it's changed there. So I'm hoping this one will as well. Okay, there we go. And I think, yeah, because we're going to move eventually move, remove these trees here. But we'll do that a little later. I think that's a good place to wrap it up. This video's gone on for a far-fetched episode. It's gone on for probably long enough. I uh, hope I haven't bored you with just random... Uh random stuff sometimes the it's hard to like have a schedule because we're just kind of trying to find out random stuff and i thought it'd be cool to play at night time uh so i hope you enjoy just walking around anyway uh and it's and and you don't mind it's not too structured um but yeah so thank you so much for watching of course and thank you of course to the channel members for making this happen your support just keeps this channel going it keeps it growing and i just i couldn't do it without without you so thank you so much and everyone watching really appreciates your support as well um, because it gives them something to watch too so please know you're very much appreciated i hope you're still enjoying this series don't forget to leave your feedback below and of course i hope you enjoyed the nintendo direct or you enjoyed the nintendo direct and i'll see you tomorrow bye